Hello there, Taurus. Welcome into Sage Sunset Healing Tarot. Thank you for being here, and I do hope you are doing well. Thank you so much for hitting the like button. Thank you for sharing the messages with those you love and for subscribing to the channel. Getting some love messages here for you, Taurus. So, welcome in. And I'm seeing there's a past person that wants to re enter your life. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, but not necessarily. And this could be happening quickly. Maybe this person wants to come in and speak to you. Or Taurus, it could be reverse, where it is you that wants to go in and speak to this person. Um, the, uh, Yeah, yeah, because the Five of Cups came out and I feel it, it's you that wants to go in and speak to this person. Um, There's Swords Energy here also, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. There's a strong soulmate energy here of two people that are similar in thinking in how they act how they take action in um, de their determination when it comes to willpower drive all right um this person can I, as i say be water sign but i'm also seeing swords energy which is air Okay, so maybe there is a separation or just there's just this need to come together with this person. Um, so I, I, as if someone is focusing on, I don't feel manifestation energy, but they have an intention of reuniting of, or maybe collaborating or coming into connection again with this fellow love person here that they want to create happiness with. Okay, so if some of you are not currently with this person, you know, maybe the relationship ended. Maybe someone was investing money or time or energy in other people, situations, maybe in family, friends, social life, really flirting, being flirtatious. And maybe the water sign decided to block or to, you know, put her boundaries and so on and so forth because the queen of swords vibration also feels like water energy um yeah so maybe there was even the possibility of marriage between you two you know it was maybe that powerful kind of love but one person was maybe not as invested which could have been earth sign you you Taurus and so the other person which would be water sign she decided or he decided to take himself away from the connection to secure their heart space first but it could be you that's looking toward moving toward this person again or is this person that's watching you or someone is studying or going to be recruited somewhere Wow. This is the person that you think about. The one true mate. The only the one that is your zing. Alright. This is the fine piece of mine and the fine piece of wine and the decent values. This is a soulmate energy, that one that you feel Look. twin flame vibration. Now maybe this person wants to come around to you. I don't know. But someone just wants to say something. What does this person? Who wants to say something? Oh, someone has a lot on their mind. Mm hmm. Some truth. Maybe some clarity. Maybe about a wrong decision that was made. Someone was maybe caught up in their thoughts too much, their feelings, their own stubbornness are their own old ways you know um it's as if this person wasn't allowing the sunshine this person was um screw face had had this screw face vibration toward the sunshine you know what i mean instead of this instead of allowing the sunshine to it's this person that was too stubborn you know but instead of allowing the sunshine to really uh, to, to allow things to receive to be able to, to be able to receive you know maybe that's the energy 
maybe this person you someone was giving and then another person was not receiving wasn't open wasn't open to a challenge or something um I wasn't expressing fully so maybe someone here wants forgiveness what is the knight of swords oh my god this is like a hell of a transformation because someone is feeling like it is hard not holding another person or we have the swords and the heart and then the other side the other card is saying i want to create happiness for you someone really wants to be with another person that they feel is their soulmate their twin flame and they want to just be happy with that person like this person is willing to do what it takes to correct to just to just be there to to make another person know that i've got this you know what i mean i can do this before maybe i was scared or i wasn't as invested because i was thinking this way and so on and so forth i had all these thoughts of things I was bringing with me from my past, even past emotions and all these things. But now I see you are a true reflection of myself and I'd love to unite with you. Like this person wants to meld. As I say, Taurus, this can be you toward another person or this is the person toward you. We're seeing Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Taurus, Virgo, um, Capricorn. We are seeing Air Sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. All right. You know, it could end. Oh, I hear a fatal attraction. I wasn't expecting that. But it could end in a way where... And when I feel fatal attraction, it feels like two hot energies coming together. Like... Uh, like two people were attracting each other you know what i mean so it wasn't it's not just one person that's feeling this intensity oh my goodness so the card of marriage again maybe someone is answering or saying isn't it obvious it's evident what what my answer is we have the card of romance and attracting and desires and moving toward what you desire so the card of victory here which is the six of one so the outcome of this interaction or whatever this is that's going to take place this meeting someone taking action someone deciding listen i'm going to go after what i want i'm going to speak some truth here it can be a very it can be it, i feel like it's going to be successful according to the cards you've been working working on yourself you've been something about communication here like the messages you've been sending are clear your it's not your intention but what you hold valuable your whole ideals it's been clear you've been pro it's been proven you know what i mean it's been it's evident what you desire what you want okay so i do feel two people coming together with a six and there's going to be a new beginning there may be as i say a per a marriage maybe a pregnancy i don't know like maybe there's there's supposed to be a family started with this person that this person is supposed to be your mate so let's take one how far are we in time? Good. Let's take a card. Let's take a f several cards from Tarot a bit. You know, Taurus, I feel like it's going to be hard or difficult for one person to forgive another. This person holds on to feelings and emotions. So let me tell you something. If you're going to get this person to forgive you or if you are going to forgive, you need to receive emotionally and use your discernment. Knowing someone is coming from a place of truth, from their own heart space, no one see that someone is putting out the effort. You know what I mean? That must mean something. That's why I'm saying it's going to be obvious that the answer that is the obvious the answer is obvious. You know, if someone didn't were, wasn't interested or is willing to go the extra mile or whatever to change or to they wouldn't be showing up so it's almost like relenting a little easing because it may be hard for this person to accept forgiveness or to receive or to give because I feel like this betrayal they took it hard yeah and this person took it hard 
but at the same time they weren't gonna be defeated you know this is a person that's going to say oh all right cool and then walk away and not speak to you but at the same time you know that they're not it hurts but they're going to grow build and become stronger and at the same time you know it's it's going to be hard to get back in their emotions in the same way but i do feel like someone wants to get back in that emotion again in that same way like maybe you guys were friends before yeah okay it could be a monetary offering someone is going to give someone some money or offer them money or try to end a cycle someone has been working as i say on themselves healing it's an apology it's a statement maybe a letter someone is writing something possibly or it's not it's not writing it's like showing it's more like someone is showing someone presenting someone is something to say this is me i've changed so on and so forth you know it's like giving your everything really like lay it all on the table you know what i mean like i'm offering myself up because i love you i feel like you've been working taurus on uh, a job maybe you've been hired or You've started something of your own or you're thinking of doing that or you're working toward that. Yeah, this person does not know how to feel exactly. They're kind of confused. Maybe that's a good thing because... I don't know. What is the Ten of Swords? Yeah, the Ten of Swords is the injury. It was a lot like this person suffered sleepless nights thoughts feelings emotions disturbed uh loss of self-worth and self-value and feeling alone this person if i'm to tap into that energy to tell you they went through loneliness and all of that you know what i mean betrayed you see that stabbed in the back and then this person decides to really release certain connections emotionally and focus on themselves and it started to make this person happy feel good about themselves working on themselves and building someone was pregnant i don't know and i hear a teacher taurus taurus energy <clears throat> At work, something at work, something with another person at work. Something about working together, collaboration. Oh my God, the emperor and the empress. Yeah, I literally just saw this. <laughs> so I'm seeing soulmates. You two are two of a kind. You know what I mean? Maybe as I say, the same way, you work the same way, think the same way, efficient, effective. It's no wonder you are attracted to one another. But it's also kind of this, this thing that pushes you to a way. But there could be strength and power if you learn how to work together. The emperor and the empress running kingdoms over here. I'm not sure who heard who still. But you will know. You know. You know what's up. You know. The Empress is the fool, what, the per a person that wanted to do something new, follow their hearts, be spontaneous, uh, travel a new road, take a leap of faith, was um, like a, a free-spirited person, free-thinking. Maybe it had to do with the money and the career, work, putting in the work or the effort or the grind. Maybe it's about receiving and collecting. Maybe something about money and the work here between you two and the lover's energy. I'm not playing. Both of you are soulmates. You're twin flames. Listen, even when you're not around each other, it's the thoughts. Like you two know when you're thinking about each other. It's so it's gonna you two send each other telepathic messages, yeah. Uh-huh. And feelings. 
I feel like this. Like you'll be sitting here and you know that your person, even though you haven't spoken, is thinking about you. It's like that amazing and intense and intriguing. And this person is the same with you. I feel like this person just smiles sometime when you cross their mind. You know, just maybe the things you would say or what you would do or how you would react. You know? Oh my gosh, I feel like both of you will possibly reunite. Someone is going to offer someone something, a gift. Uh huh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It may correct the situation, I don't know. But it's going to be a gift, or someone is going to receive a message. Maybe the water sign, Cancer Pisces, Scorpio is going to send a message, or will be receive a, receiving. So both people are giving here the Cancer, the water sign and the taurus sign the earth sign what people are giving and as if as if you will both be doing something differently at the same time with other people serving others but you will meet again doing this and i feel it has something to do with being out in celebration in the festive seasons coming up you will be doing this and this person, your other person will be doing another thing, another job perhaps. And then you will meet and then there's somehow, you, like, you know, it's almost like being a, at a pop-up event and both of you are showing off different things. And then the communication starts from there and so people are smiling, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. So there's a possibility of connection, of balancing the skills, um, of forgiveness here, of as accepting forgiveness. I feel like both people have grown. Yeah. Yeah. Both people have grown and are learning to manage or to some one is learning about thoughts chaotic and it's all the same. Both of you are going through the same thing but different experiences really. So it's like this chaos with decision making and clarity and focus and intention. So it affects your moods, the thoughts, the feelings, the attachments, addictions, and so on and so forth. Some people are, so, some, some of you are going back to school. Someone's going back to school, studying again, letting go, releasing the old. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right, Taurus, this has been your love messages, wonderful messages for you in this one. I do hope you found some that resonates with you and is able to help you along your journey. At this point, I ask that you hit the like button and to leave a compliment behind on the video. Share the messages. Hey, share the messages with those you love. Hit share and share the messages in your groups and so on with those you love. And if you have not yet done so, please do subscribe to the channel. All right, we have this is true love. Look at that zing again. Someone is coming forward definitely to reunite with a person that they're ready to be in love with. All right. All right, Taurus, much love. I'll see you in the next one. Take care. Remember that you're all and all is within you. Bye. CMOS heals the body by removing harmful chemicals that are caused by some foods we eat, hormones, toxic substances, and radiation from 5G from our devices. Heal your temple with the minerals of infinite oceans. CMOS has over 90 of the 102 nutrients our body needs like copper, which creates balance and harmony. To learn more about CMOS health benefits or to order your first premium grade CMOS, email italkitchenstyle at gmail.com.